Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. So today I did this holiday look. I did the Christmas night look and also the Christmas morning look. Um, if you're like, if your family is anything like mine, my mom loves to take pictures in the morning and I always look like a hot mess, so you gotta do a little something. And then for the Christmas night, when you go out with family and go to dinner or have dinner at your house or open presents with um, the big family group, this is a nice look. This look is also loosely inspired by Jaclyn Hill with her newest video. When I say loosely, I mean very loosely. I mean, it's essentially the same look, but like very different. Very, very different. So if you want to see how I got this look, or I'll put in a picture of the other look right here, just keep watching. So we're going to jump right off into the Christmas morning look. I'm going to start off with the NYX Above and Beyond Concealer in shade Medium. This is going to just conceal my under eyes. So next I'm going to go ahead and grab the MAC Sculpting Powder in Medium Deep. I'm going to use this to kind of cancel out some of the pasty kind of ashiness from the concealer and to also add a little bit of pigmentation all over my face. The next product I'm going to grab is the Maybelline, or not Maybelline, the Benefit Gimme Brow in shade 5. This is just going to add a little bit of thickness to my eyebrows and make it look like I do have some product in them. I can never go without highlight, so today for a highlighter, I'm going to just apply a little bit of my ColourPop Super Shock Cheek Highlight, I think it's called, in the color Churro, just to the top of my cheekbones, a little bit to my nose and my cupid's bow. Next, I'm going to go ahead and add a little bit of mascara. I'm using the Shea Moisture Volumizing Mascara. I'm just going to apply this to my upper and lower lash line. Now for lip gloss, I'm using the NYX Mega Shine Lip Gloss in the shade Natural. I already have a little bit of lip, bal bal lip balm on, so I'm just going to tap it on to create a little bit more pigment. So now let's get into the Christmas night look. I'm going to start off by mixing the Shea Moisture Weightless Shea Serum Foundation and my Maybelline uh, Fit Me Matte and Poreless. My Maybelline Matte and Poreless is in the shade 360 Mocha and my Shea Moisture Foundation is in the shade Toffee. So now to create a little bit more drama to look, I'm going to cream contour. So I'm grabbing the LA Girl uh, Pro Concealer in the shade Mahogany. I'm actually mixing this with a little bit of my foundation because it's a very ashy tone and it's a little bit too dark for me actually. Um, so I'm mixing a little bit of that with my foundation and I'm going to use that to cream contour. <laughs> Seal my face, I'm grabbing the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer in the shade 25 Medium and I'm going to apply this to under my eyes and I'm going to eventually put a little bit um, on my nose but I don't show that part.
grabbing my Coty Air Spun Powder in the shade Translucent and I'm going to put this underneath my eyes to set my concealer and I'm also going to put this a little bit under where I've cream contoured to make it a little bit sharper. So now I'm going to grab that MAC Sculpting Powder once again and I'm going to use this to set my whole entire face. So next to kind of intensify my cream contour, I'm taking the Makeup Geek Contour Powder in Deal Breaker and I'm just going to buff that over where I've already cream contour. shot of this product but for this I'm for highlighting I'm going to be using the Becca shimmering skin perfector in rose gold So now to start off the eyes, I'm grabbing Makeup Geek's eyeshadow in Cocoa Bear. This is a warm brown. Um, on the screen, it kind of pays off as an orangey base color. Um, when it is, while it is orangey based, it's not as orange as it appears. I'm going to be grabbing a big fluffy brush with this. I'm going to be putting this all over my crease. Um, I'm going to slowly build this shadow up because this is the only shadow we're going to have in the crease. I'm going to be grabbing the Churro Highlighter from ColourPop again. This is going to be the base shadow um, for our whole entire eye look. I'm grabbing my Too Faced Love palette with the shade Adore and I'm going to top the Churro highlighter with this shade. Now for the lower lash line, I'm grabbing a little bit more of Cocoa Bear and just running this on my lower lash line to create more depth. And for mascara, I'm using the Bobbi Brown um, Smoky Eye Mascara, <laughs> and I'm just going to apply this to my top and bottom mas or my top and bottom lashes.
tips, I'm grabbing the NYX Butter Gloss in the shade Red Velvet. And that is the end of this tutorial. I really hope you guys enjoyed this look. If you did, please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Love you bunches. Bye.